Hello and welcome to Someka Supply Chain KPI Dashboard for Google Sheets. To use the template, make sure you're online and sign in with your Google account. Then you have to make a copy of this file. Just go to File, then click on Make a Copy. Key performance indicators are crucial for any company, and this tool lets you track these figures. This tool has two main sections. The first section is where you can input your values, like metric settings, current year actuals, current year targets, and previous year actuals. And the second section is where we can analyze the results, like the monthly dashboard and trends and charts. Let's start with the KPI metrics. This is where you can add all your KPI metrics. First, set your starting year from the starting date setting. Then you can add your each of your KPI metrics. This tool comes with the dummy data, but of course you will enter your own data into this template. Let's add some data for demonstration purposes. So I'm gonna add operational costs under warehouse. Write down the unit. And if a KPI indicates a better performance when it's lower, select yes. And choose the cumulative calculation method. You can also write down descriptions for each KPI. So I'm going to add the operational cost values to each table. Starting with current year actuals. I'm going to write the values manually, but of course you can easily copy and paste your data from an external source. Add in the target value for the current year now. And add in the data for previous year actuals. Now that we input all our data, we can check the current year actual cumulative table. So this section shows you the cumulative data for the current year and is calculated automatically once you enter all your data. And you can check the cumulative data for current year targets and previous year actuals. Let's check the monthly dashboard section. This is where you can track your monthly and cumulative performance for each KPI. And once you enter all your data, the dashboard section will update itself accordingly. Now we can see the operational cost on the dashboard. And you may choose the month from the upper left section here. And lastly, let's check the trends and charts. With trends and charts, you can also track your monthly and cumulative performance with charts and graphics for each KPI. And you may choose the KPI from the drop-down menu above. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to check our other templates at someka.net.